Does it feel like a Polokwane dove? Does it feel like it? Does it feel like a Polokwane dove? Yeah, I think we can say that because of, of where they originate from, yeah. So I think we can call the dove, yeah. Are you relatively, you know, happy with the draw? Yeah, very happy with the draw. I think it's going to be an exciting match. Um, a lot to play for. Um, yeah, and they, they're doing well. We're doing, we're doing fairly well. We're happy with, with our start of the season. So, yeah, so there's a lot at stake here and also the bragging rights, of course. Yeah, so looking forward to it. How would you assess the start to the season for Kukulukwani season? Um, consider, considering the, the teams you played against and how many games you played, we're still on par with our, our target, you know, so um, I would say we've, we've been doing fairly well. Um, we, so, so far so good, yeah. Kukulukwani City showed last season that they, they can compete, they have the pedigree. Is they feeling now that it might be time for, for Silva, particularly in this competition? Um, yeah, I think the, it's always it's always difficult the first time you, you're in the PSL to stay there, and then it doesn't get easier in the second season as well. And hence, I think our, our start of the first few games was fairly well. And if you continue this momentum, um, we can do even better than last season. Uh, we managed to end top eight last season, so we are an ambitious club. We want to end better than before, and just to show who we to, uh, just. If you see who we competed against in these previous teams, I think we we, we managed to, to compete against the top teams and having said that I think it's possible for, for the team to achieve some way. Yeah. How are you been in situations where moves don't happen? You know, what would your word of advice be for sure? Are your teammate, you know, being linked to the number of moves that didn't happen? How does he keep his head down in this going? Yeah, like I mentioned before, it's, it's a, it's, it was a really complex situation. But he's a professional. This is the nature of the job, you know. And as pros, we need to, we need to be professional because in this game, if you, if you get frustrated because of things outside the field, it affects your game. And in in a year or two years time, we're talking a different story than today. So you know, my advice to him is always this: you know, you can't control the external, but you can control your attitude, you can control how you perform, uh, the effort you give, the attitude you give you on the field. And that's the important thing, you know. Um, and yeah, I think I think he's been he's been managing it well as a youngster. Um, he's uh, he's wiser than what a lot of what a lot of us think. And um, and yeah he's he's giving the best for his team and um, yeah, the, the club is ambitious, so it shows, you know, by keeping such quality players, it shows the ambition of the club. So, um, yeah, together with, 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 the, with the likes of, of players like Oswin and, and the rest of the fighters we have in the team, um, I'm really confident and positive about my team and um, looking forward to what the year uh, brings ahead. Yeah.